It's all smiles while signing autographs. These are some of Canada's best track and field stars. Good luck in Paris. Here to clinch a coveted spot on Team Canada in Paris. Everything's on the line, right? Four years of training, competition, grinding, you know, comes down to here. The grass at the line, he's got the gold medal! Andre de Grasse, already Canada's most decorated male Summer Olympic medalist, is hoping to add to that haul. I think every game is a little bit different when you get there. Um, the goosebumps are still there, the nerves, the anxiety a little bit, but you just try to control that and just have fun and stay focused and be in the moment. The Bell Trials, one of the last sporting events in Canada before the Olympic Games in Paris. Of those hopefuls, our athletes already having breakout seasons. Christopher Morales-Williams is the reigning NCAA champion in the 400 meter, many calling him a real medal contender. 25-year-old Audrey Leduc has not only beaten the Canadian record in the 100 meters, but also in the 200. Pressure much? I put my pressure on me and I think this is the only pressure that counts. So I want to do well, I want to compete, run fast, I win a medal in this weekend. So I'm just going to focus on this. And in the field events, Canada is also a major contender. Both Ethan Katzberg and Cameron Rogers are reigning world champions. In the hammer throw, both are record breakers. Shot putter Sarah Mitten is also expected to shine. Notably absent from these trials, though, is decathlete Pierce Lepage, who has been given a medical exemption. The reason, so far, unknown. After all the medals here are handed out, it'll be pretty obvious who will be packing their bags for Paris. But nothing is certain until the official team is named on July 2nd. Sarah Levitt, CBC News, Montreal.